Gaius Pius Asuvius Tetricus was emperor of the Gallic Empire, reigning 271 to 274, succeeding the murdered Victorinus and ending with his surrender on the battlefield to the Roman Emperor Aurelian. Tetricus, who ruled with his son, Tetricus II, was the last of the Gallic emperors. Reign. Tetricus was a senator born to a noble family of Gallic extraction. He was appointed to the administrative position of Prezes Provinciary of Gallia Aquitania in 270, a position he still held when the murder of Victorinus was announced in early 271. Victorinus' her mother, Victoria, located at Colonia Claudia Ara Agrippinensium, managed to keep control of the political situation after her son's death, through her influence. She bribed the army to declare the absent Tetricus emperor. Tetricus accepted the army's nomination and took the purple at Berdagala in Gaul, moving from Berdagala. He was on his way to Augusta Treverorum when Tetricus was forced to repel Germanic tribes that took advantage of the confusion following the death of Victorinus to invade Gaul. By the end of 271 Tetricus had made Augusta Treverorum, near the vital Rhine border, his capital, and had celebrated a Victoria Germanica, but was again called out in 272 to deal with a fresh incursion that reached the River Loire. However, continued invasions across the Rhine and along the coasts forced Tetricus to abandon the frontier forts and withdraw the troops to defend the interior of Gaul. Regardless of his difficulties with the Germanic invasions, Tetricus was recognized as emperor throughout Britain and most of Gaul apart from Narbonensis, where Placidianus had reclaimed some territory under Claudius II Gothicus. Although Tetricus made no move to expand his territorial reach, he did invest time and resources reclaiming some provinces that had been reconquered by the Central Empire, such as southeastern Aquitania and the western parts of Narbonensis. Nevertheless, his regime was destabilized by attempts of certain areas to declare their allegiance to the Roman Emperor Aurelian, such as the city of Argentaratum in 272. It was to shore up his internal support that Tetricus eventually appointed his son, Tetricus II, as Caesar sometime in 273. After celebrating his second consulship on 1 January 273, it did little to stem in his faltering regime as in late 273 or early 274, Faustinus, provincial governor of Gallia Belgica, rebelled against him in Augusta Treverorum. To add to his woes, by the middle of 273, the Emperor Aurelian set out to reconquer the western provinces of the Roman Empire, following his victories in the east, preparing for his advance. Tetricus and his son celebrated their joint consulship on 1 January 274 before marching southward from his capital to meet Aurelian who was advancing into northern Gaul. The decisive battle took place near Chalons sur marne in late February 274 where Tetricus' army was cut to pieces in an event remembered as the Catalonian Catastrophe. By March 274, both Tetricus and his son had surrendered to Aurelian. Later imperial propaganda declared that Tetricus had agreed to surrender to Aurelian in exchange for his life. But the price was to be his betrayal of his army prior to the battle, which in the event continued regardless. It was claimed that Tetricus quoted Virgil in his letter to Aurelian, Eripi me his, invicta, malise. According to literary sources, after being displayed as trophies at Aurelian's triumph in Rome, the lives of Tetricus and his son were spared by Aurelian, and Tetricus was even given the title of corrector Lucanii Bratiorum, that is governor of a southern region of Italia. Tetricus died at an unknown date in Italy. He is listed as one of Rome's 30 tyrants in the Historia Augusta, Numismatics. The Antoninianae of Tetricus were the most frequently imitated prototypes for barbarous radiates, barbaric imitations of Roman coins, 